Morning everyone, back again. Hope you're all right and keeping safe and well. I've got another craft for you this morning and it's two things really. First of all, something that we do quite a lot at Toddlers and you always love it. I'm sure you've done it at Toddlers, nearly all of you. Some of you might have done it at home as well. And it's marble rolling. So I've got, I've only got two pots here. You can have as many as you want. I've got two pots with painting. I've got green in this pot and pinky red in this pot and a spoon. So that's just to save me getting my fingers painted. So we'll take the marble out and we'll pop it in the tray. Now I hope my cameraman can see it rolling around. And then you just take your marble, you see it in there, for a walk. And when the paint starts to run out, you take it out and you pop it back in the paint. We'll have the pink one this time. <clears throat> so it leaves a trail. It's always nice and delicate. Whee! Whee! Should we have should we have two together this time? I'll just roll it around in the paint a bit, that green one. chasing each other and if you're very careful you can get them to jump and then they leave little dots. And it looks good for this. Tip it all the way so it goes backwards and forwards. You don't have to have a big tray like this, you can have anything. It's a good idea if it's got a lip on but you could have a small piece of paper in a margarine pot. Very good, so that didn't take long, did it? And then you get a really nice pattern where the marbles be. Now, your story today that Wendy's going to be telling you is about a postman. And what we're going to do is when this is dry, you and your mummies can use it to make something. So I've made a kite here, from a piece that I did earlier and I've made some butterflies and I've put them onto card and can you see it says there thank you and it says on this one on the string of the kite I've written thank you thank you and if you listen to the story Wendy will tell you what she's going to suggest that you might do with these cards if you do this and then make a card. So you might want to make a kite like me or a butterfly, but you have your own ideas. You might want to do a flower or you might want to do, can't think, all sorts of nice things. I'm sure you'll come up with some nice, some nice ideas of your own. And then listen to the story. I'm not gonna give it away and Wendy will share with you what she thinks it might be nice for you to do with the cards. Okay, so have a lovely rest of the week and I'll see you again next week. Bye everyone.